We're now going to talk about the third principle of timing is how to go forward. That part starts when you change direction. As you remember, the backswing goes here, and when you change direction, that is the acceleration phase. It's a very short uh, six inch space where the player has to decide what speed he's going to hit on the ball. The next part is the contact. The ball stays on the racket for a very, very short time, between one to three one thousandths of a second, and that is too short to be able to control. The third part is the follow through. And you follow through all the way until where you started from, if you do a slow stroke, or if you hit the ball hard, you go beyond the neutral position in the follow through. Okay, now we're going to look at how Eric is executing his uh, forward motions in his strokes.